Changing block properties to by layer. If we're just editing normal blocks, we can erase or copy or rotate those things. But when we want to change those properties, such as its line weight and its color and line uh, type and things like that, we can either go in and change the block definition and resave it as a, a new block, or we can go into the set by layer command. So if we go into home tab, we go to modify, and we want to go to the set by layer command. We hit the down arrow. Oop. We'll hit the down arrow. And in the upper left hand corner, we have set to by layer. When we click on that, we have uh, we can select the objects or settings. Let's go to hit S for settings. And I'll bring up a dialog box of everything we want to control. Uh, and we want to change properties. And we don't want to change the properties of material because that's more of a 3D thing. And we'll say OK. Now it's a select object. So we'll select the block that we're interested in. And I'll pick this block. Pick anywhere on the block. And I'll hit Enter. And it says change by block uh, to by layer. And I'll say yes. Include blocks. I'll say yes. And boom. It changed it back to all by layer. So this is a handy way if you make a mistake and you don't do the created on layer zero. Uh, you did one of the other methods. This is the way of fixing it. So uh, it's back to normal. So changing block properties to by layer. Uh, once again, we find that in the modify and over here that's set by layer.